Nebraska undefeated. The winner goes to the Orange Bowl to play undefeated Florida State. The loser goes to the Cotton Bowl. As Jim Brock said, can't you call them the runner-up? They will play the Southwest Conference champion. So there really is not going to be a loser as far as postseason play is concerned. But prior to something else, as Keeling hangs the ball high, and it goes to Anthony Steeles. And Steeles breaks out of there, and he gets into the loose, and he's on his way, all the way to the 44-yard line. They come up now with Andra Franklin, and I am hip, set behind Quinn, the quarterback. Quinn still got it. Gets out to the left side into the open field. He gets a couple of blocks to get him around the corner, and he runs for a first down. Here are the young men who are in the backfield. That's Jeff Quinn making his second start since the Iowa game. Andrew Franklin, big, heavy, set, good-looking fellow who's a heck of a blocker. I am hip, you know. Kenny Brown, a very dangerous, good football player. And Tim Smith, the split in, who doubles as the punter. So here's Nebraska operating at the Oklahoma 43. On first down, Brown goes in motion, and Hip has the ball. Notice that little skipping, slipping, sliding kind of motion he has. He just dances at you, and then bang, he's gone. Big Junior Miller, said by some the best tight end in the country. Mark Goodspeed, 260 pounds. John Havkos, 230-pound guard. Kelly Saulfeld, 248 at center. Randy Schleusner, 232 at guard. Dan Steiner, 238 at tackle. Second down and seven. The ball is inside the 40. Hip again. And I am hip to the 35. He, defensively for Oklahoma, Barry Burgett, Keith Gary, John Lewis, Richard Turner, and Bruce Tayton. Linebackers and defensive backs, George Cumbie, Barry Dittman, Basil Banks, Mike Babb, Sherwood Taylor, and Bud Hebert. Taylor is out. Riley is in right now as the Sooners set up a goal line defense on third down and two, trying to stop Nebraska right here. The ball is handed off. It is kept, however, by the quarterback. Up Owen Field in the press area that you can see the curvature of the earth. <laughs> Quinn turns. He's going to put it up. He's got some heat. And he's still not down. Now he is all the way back at the 46-yard line. Now it is second down from the 45 of Oklahoma. They've got to go to the 22 to get the first down. They give the ball to the eye back, and Hip's got a yard, and that'll do it. Brown goes wide left. Keep your eye on 89. He's the biggest man, tallest man out on the field. Then back to throw it. He swings it out to Hip. Hip's got two blockers in front of him, but he goes down at the 42-yard line as... Here's the punt by Smith, hung up into the wind. There'll be no return as it goes banging to the sidelines and out of bounds. So that's going to work out all right. It was a 29-yard punt, but it's inside the 20, marked down around the 13-yard line with J.C. Watts opening at quarterback. Billy Sims will be one of the halfbacks out of the wishbone formation. David Overstreet, a junior from Big Sandy, Texas, the other halfback. Stanley Wilson, freshman fullback, and Freddie Nixon, one of the wide receivers. Sometimes you'll see two wide receivers in for Oklahoma. J.C. Watts brings them up now as they break the bone and uh, put a man in motion, give the ball off inside to Wilson, the fullback, and he goes from the 13-yard line up to about the 16. The defensive unit for Nebraska lines up, uh, excuse me, I'm sorry, the offensive front for Oklahoma, 82 is Forrest Valora, Louis Obre from New Orleans, big tackle, 250, Terry Crouch, 242 at guard, Paul Tabor, the center, 242, Don Key is the guard at 245, Five, a freshman, Ed Culver, 253, a tackle. Well, they're plenty big up front. It is second down and seven for the Sooners. And it is Sims cutting over the right side, and the right side of the line gave him a great block. Key and Culver and Valora, and they turn him up across the 26 to the 27 for a first down. Now we can give you the defense for Nebraska. Lawrence Cole, Rod Horn, Kerry Weinmester. Bill Barnett and Derry Nelson, the linebackers, Brent Williams, Tom Varing, the secondary, Lindquist, Means, Gary, and Leroy, and that secondary is pretty good. First down for the Sooners at their own 27, no score, first quarter. And penalty flags are down. I think the man in motion might have turned up field a little bit too soon. The Homer people are clapping their hands like it's offside against Nebraska, and that's what it is. I've got a nosebleed. <laughs> First and five. Watch to throw it. Puts it in the air. The pass is incomplete. Second man, Sim. He's gone. Goodbye. He Penalty 
flag is thrown back at the 15-yard line. You know there might have been a clip. Clip, Keith, you can't believe it. Ballora was trying to get away from the back defensive back means knowing that he had the touchdown scored and he accidentally bumped into him clipping penalty from the end zone we can see the blocking watch Sims we see exactly why he's so outstanding he cuts right back and he's got an open field because the secondary is playing so close now watching the left corner of your screen hopefully we can see the unintentional clip the Oklahoma lineman right there was trying to get out of his way and accidentally bumped into it. And it's first down Oklahoma at the Nebraska 30-yard line. So the Huskers dodge a bullet. Watts going down the line on the option, turns it to about the 28. And accidentally, it was Freddie Nixon, number 11. Call it the 29, make it second down at about nine as Watts comes back to put it up, has all day, goes deep in the corner, and the pass is intercepted in the corner by Andy Means, and Nebraska has the football back. So Oklahoma loses a touchdown. Andy Means comes up with an interception on the overthrown pass. And the Huskers are back in business. First down at their own 20 and no score. Franklin and Hip set up behind Quinn. With Smith wide right. Round the wing back. And it goes to Hip. And I am Hip gets a couple. Again out of the eye on second down. Let's give him eight yards to go from just outside the 22. Again, it is hip. And hip pops it up. He's the fastest back that they have at Nebraska. He's got it. He's outside. He's got the first down. And then some. All the way out to the 48-yard line. First down, 48-yard line of Nebraska. No score, first quarter, seven and a half minutes to go. Quinn turns around, looks for somebody, and then turns it upfield. Second down and six from the 48 of Oklahoma. Red line. And he hits with some authority on the right side. Third down, about two. Big guy Franklin hit at the line of scrimmage. There's no way he's going to get it. Basil Banks will do the receiving for Oklahoma. Beautiful kick. Beautiful spinning spiral. Forcing Banks to call fair catch inside the 10-yard line. It is first down at the 8-yard line of Oklahoma. And Wilson, the fullback, is in motion. And penalty flags are all over the field. So Billy's having a hard time today. He's picking up yardage, but he's been wiped out by mistakes. And it'll be first down and about 13. Ball is handed off to Billy Sims. Sims gets to the five. Ball is just over the five, where it is second down at about 12. J.C. Watts hands the ball off to Sims, and Billy's in the open again. And he runs up football out across the 20-yard line and gets a first down. 68 total for Billy. First down Sooners. Ball goes to the first man out of the wishbone. Stanley Wilson, the second down and seven for Oklahoma. It's Wilson again. And he's got a first down. Oklahoma. Lee's in there at 224 pounds. He's bigger than Winemaster. Third and hand the ball off inside to Billy Sims. It's second down. Short eight, long seven. Sims has got it. Sims across the 45. Out. Watts still got it. In trouble. Number 55 came across to slow him down. He's got the wind at his back. He knocked it a mile. Ball is taken by Kenny Brown. And first down with Quinn at quarterback. Franklin and Redwine set behind him out of the eye formation. Must be checking off, taking a long count at the line of scrimmage. Pitches the ball to Redwine. Pretty good defensive flow by the Oklahoma Center. Second down and eight from the 17, out near the 18. Quinn still got it. Puts it up deep. Over the middle for Miller. Oh, my goodness, he almost salvaged it. Quinn throws to Smith, and it's behind him. Tim was out there, man. Third punt for Tim Smith. That's a good kick into that win. He makes Banks wave fair catch, but uh, there's too many people back there, and Basil decides to let it go, and it finally tumbles on out of bounds. 
Oklahoma comes up. Ball at the 37-yard line. Billy Sims has the ball. Billy dives it across the 40. To that one's played uh, next week. Ball is handed off inside to that young man, Stanley Wilson. The ball had just been a yard longer. He was gone. There goes Sims. Oh, he is some running back. Down to the 30-yard line. First down, Oklahoma. Time has run out. First quarter of play. And there is no score between Nebraska and Oklahoma. 30's gone over 100. They give the ball off to the first man out of the wishbone, the fullback Wilson. Wilson. Tallahassee. Ball is given to Sims. And Sims dives it down to about the 21 for 282. He's got it again. He's trying for the first down. Just depends on how far they'll place the ball. And they scored on short yardage last year, remember, Keith? Yep. Fourth down. Quarterback Watts. Julius Caesar Watts dives in for the first down. Out it goes to Overstreet. Good play by number 66, Brent Williams. Williams. Strikes that filled it well. Here's Watts with the ball, turns it upfield. Gets inside the 20 to about the 19. Fumble! Picked up by Watts. Fumbles it again. Going to the sidelines. Penalty flags all over the field. All sides, I guess, has to be. It is not, however. All right, six-man front for the Huskers. Wilson goes in motion. Watts coming down the line. He is not going to get there. Matter of fact, he really didn't even get to the line of scrimmage for a 31-yard field goal attempt. He's a freshman, barefooted kicker. He is four out of five from this distance, but you've got to add something here because of the wind. He's got it up. A lot of leg. And it's good. Well, he just nailed it. He sucked that thing all the way up into the crowd. 11.33 to go in the first half of play. Oklahoma gets on the board first to lead Nebraska. Three to nothing. Nebraska point of view. He pops it straight up in the air. And it is fielded by Nebraska. Picked up by number 44. That is Jim Katerra. Back in at the eye-back position for the Huskers. Quinn gives the ball off to Andrew Franklin, the fullback. Quinn hands the ball to hit. And uh, I am just sort of skated a little bit until goal line defense set up on third and a yard and a half for Oklahoma. Hip has it, dives for it, and appears to have it. Of their decision. It's close. It is short. Not Tom Osmond for sure. No, sir. Fourth down. Quarterback. Well, he might have made it, but by golly, he didn't get it by much. They reverse it to Miller, Junior Miller. The tight end coming back on a reverse. The 42-yard line. Second down and the short five. Quinn pitches the ball to I.M. Hip. Hip spins it back inside. Third down and four. Option. Hip. Franklin, good block, but he can't sustain the block. First down from the Oklahoma 35. Quinn still got it and got some daylight. I'll tell you, that's a pretty cute little play right there. It's good to just short of the 10-yard line. Better than 200 pounds. It's just short of the 10-yard line as they send Jarvis Redwine in motion out of the eye back. He's got the ball. On to the corner. Touchdown, Cornhusker. that fella out there one-on-one -on -one, and he is terrifying. He runs into Sherwood Taylor right at the corner of the end zone and they give him six. You can see that Quinn had a flood pattern and he chose his third receiver red line and he catches it and goes in for the touchdown. Sukup is in for the extra point try. It is up. 
and it is good. With seven minutes and 36 seconds to play in the second quarter, the Cornhuskers of Nebraska have gone to the lead, seven to three. Darrell Shepard, number eight. High kick. Shepard angles under it at the four. Almost fell down. He brings the ball back out across to the 20-yard line. All right, here's Oklahoma now. Trailing in the ball game. The ball is given off to the fullback, Wilson. And Wilson from the 22-yard line. That's Wilson in motion. And Sim gets the first down. Watch pass. Thrown out to Nixon. Nixon makes the catch at the 43-yard line. Six-man front defensive before Nebraska. The ball given to Sims, and Sims getting, again, very good blocking from the right side. Fullback Wilson. Sims. Billy Sims now with 131 yards in the ball game. Watts going down on the option. Gets past the yard marker and gets another Sooner first down. First down Sooners, Nebraska 40. Wilson the fullback. Second down seven from the Husker 37. Wilson again. He broke one tackle. Third down two. Sims. Whoop and over it is close. Second man Overstreet. David Overstreet is second down and four. Sims breaks the first tackle. On third down and very short, they go to Billy Sims, and he's at the Nebraska 19-yard line for an Oklahoma first down. So Watts wants to put it up. Valora's there, and he missed him. And it's tied in for us, Valora. Outside the sim. Down he goes. Great play by 92. Gary Nelson. From Watch back to throw. Yep. Gonna run it. And he runs it to the 18-yard line before he is pulled down. That's now he's gonna try one from 34 yards. He's got it up. He's got enough leg. And he missed it. That's what that wind will do to you. It sort of swirls around. The ball got up there and it hung, and the wind just kind of moved it right on out of the goalpost. First down from the 20 for Nebraska. Let's see if they want to run out the clock. They hand the ball off to uh, to uh, uh, Jarvis, uh, uh, Jarvis Redwine. The wind's going to throw. Nope, has to pull it down. He looked downfield at uh, Kenny Brown. 18 seconds now as the clock has stopped to move the chains. Quinn getting the first down up at the 35-yard line. It's now running with 13 seconds to go in the first half. He'll throw. He hums it over the middle. It's picked off. He threw the ball in the crowd, and Barry Burgett, defensive end, who had dropped it. Well, let's see if Barry Switzer's got something he can show us. Watts back to throw. To throw. Now he's going to have to run. JC's got some open field now. He gets it in the air. Nixon's down there. Knocked out of bounds at the five yard line. And penalty flags thrown back up field in one of the great scrambles <laughs> of the month by JC Watts. Time is still out for Andy Means, and I must say that Nixon, however, is 5'11", 195, so he outsizes uh, that corner man. Let's see if they're going to test this new defensive back. They break the bone here, send uh, Overstreet in motion, and Watts is going to go with it. He's got Melora out there all by himself. The tight end is gone. Touchdown, Oklahoma. Laura 
gets out all alone, gets away from Paul Letcher, goes down and into the corner for the touchdown, and the Sooners are back on top, and Orange is being thrown out of the stands out on the field because the winner of this ball game will go to the Orange Bowl. He's got it. Pops it up. That'll cost him five. He'll do it again. Michael tries it again. This time he gets it. And it's Kenny Brown from the five. And he gets out for the 23. Pull back Franklin. Mark him near the 27, second down and six. Travis Redwine, the eye back. You know that Oklahoma had 10 people up on that defensive line. Oh, the ball was going to be vital, and they've only completed two passes. Just short. They got caught with their punt receiving team, kick receiving team on the field. They wanted their big defensive bunch up there, and they got them all stuffed in the middle. As Quinn dives for his first down, he looks to me like he's got it. And a first down for the Cornhuskers. Boy, that was a considered risk. Oklahoma leading 10 to 7 as Quinn turns and gives to Franklin. He breaks it big. Red wine. Tayton. Second down and 12. Ball back near the 42 yard line. Stands up, wanted to pop it. Now he's got to run it. And he gets it out to the 48. Barrett's third down and six for Nebraska. The ball out of their 48 yard line. Quinn gives it off inside, and the ball. Well, uh, let's go back and we'll show you this play. So you remember the Boomerowski a few years ago? Half cost wound up with a football. Now watch it. Watch your quarterback take it. Puts it in there. He hands the ball, Keith, into the stomach of the offensive guard. He's running in the other direction. Obviously, our cameraman lost it. Everybody else So did, did I. <laughs> <laughs> I knew the play was coming, and I still didn't see it. It's a first down for Nebraska at the 41-yard line. Quint, penalty flags on the field, goes deep. Junior Miller is in the end zone, and the ball is just tipped away. After being faked to the fullback, and half cost had it, and got it is first down. Back at the 45 of Nebraska, they've got to go near the Oklahoma 30 for their first down. Ball goes outside, Red Wine's out there. Oh, was that a brilliant play by the quarterback, Quinn, and he goes all the way down to the Oklahoma 26-yard line. 30-yard pickup. <laughs> Franklin the fullback. Red wine. Then the quarterback wants to throw. Now throws and throws it in the crowd. He's going into the win, so look at a 35-yard attempt, but add something to it because of the win. Add an extra five yards to it because of the win. Low snap. The kick is up. The kick is long enough, and he missed it. J.C. Watts gives the ball to Billy Sims. Billy Sims fumbles the ball. Nebraska falls on it, recovers it. And it does it is Mark Leroy, number 23, the senior from Seattle. All right, red wine is the eye back. Quinn turns, gives it to Brown. There's your wing back counter. And they don't get much out of it. Big opportunity for the Cornhuskers. Pull back Franklin to the 20. It is third down and five for Nebraska at the 20. I am hip. Penalty flag. One thing they did not need was 
Third and 20 from the 35 for Nebraska. Quinn swings it out. That's a forward pass. Red wine more than the opponents do. Smith to punt. Hangs it up and knocks it into the end zone. Oklahoma will get the football first down at the 20 for Oklahoma. Watts gives the ball. Sims. Billy. Watts the quarterback. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> that was all in the fourth quarter after running on fourth down when the fans yelled. The kick is away and it is fielded and brought back by Dave Legal from the 38 first down. Travis Redwine got four wins for Tom, uh, 65 wins in the six years up to this game. Patera, the fullback, carries the ball, and it'll wind on down. So we'll continue after this message for one of our sponsors and station identification. What a game between Nebraska and Oklahoma, the Big 8 Conference Championship on the line. The winner goes to the Orange Bowl, the loser goes to the Cotton Bowl. Bragging rights worth who knows what. Nebraska third down and three from their own 44-yard line. It's a long three. Red wine hit behind the line of scrimmage, and Oklahoma came pouring in to home. He's second in the nation, Keith. Good punt return. High kick. Banks will not have a chance. A fair catch is called for him. BYU, the Cougars, and the San Diego State Aztecs, the winner of the back goes in motion. And the ball off inside. Comes to run in the football. Watts almost dropped that ball. Gets it off. Pass is incomplete for the first down. Billy Sims. Oh, he almost broke it out of there. No pressure. Beautiful kick. Kenny Brown. Down he goes. I'm hip. Is the eye back. Franklin the fullback. Quinn the quarterback. Quinn to throw it. Over the middle it goes. And the pass is incomplete. Second down and 10 from the 24. Put it up again. Pass is complete to the fullback Franklin out of the backfield. And he's got a first down. First down, Huskers. Fullback Franklin. Second down and seven for Nebraska. Quinn getting some pressure. Loses the ball. It is covered. Total loss of 21 yards. Third down and about 16. Quinn on an option. Goes outside. Oh, my goodness. Makes the deep man to receive the punt from Smith. This time, Tim hits a beauty. Oh, look at this. It's down. Inside the 10 at the four-yard line. Right now, it is Oklahoma backed up on the six-yard line. They give the ball to Overstreet, and David breaks it out to the 18 for a first down at the 19. Wilson, the fullback, to the 20. Oh, but he is now stopped. The quarterback for Nebraska on the next possession. Billy Sims. Look out. It's a foot race. All the way to the Nebraska eight-yard line. Billy Sims. Seventy-one yards. Street has it and didn't get an inch. From the nine. Quarterback Watts to Sims. Fumbles the ball. They're going to put it down right there. Winters is in replacing Sims. And here comes Watts. 
behind the line of scrimmage. They had him, but he wiggled away and got it back up to about the three. Team that goes. Watch for the ball. Turns it. Touchdown. He's already signaled the fumble is academic. Sims. So big in it. Keeling's extra point is good. Gets it well. Steele has to let it bounce because of the wind. Now he's got it. He is nailed. First down. 17 to 7 ball game Sooners. Quinn stands up, throws that little pop to that big tight end, Junior Miller, and he carries people. Ball is right on target, and Taylor brings it back. Back to live action as the pass is thrown short. Intended for Tim Smith. Second and 10 from the 38. Quinn puts it up to the sidelines. Pass complete. McCready, first down. Yes, sir. First down, Nebraska. Got to get a touchdown in a hurry. Give the ball to Craig Johnson and Johnson. Second down, call it six. Quarterback Quinn still has it. He is shirt tail. You said he state seen over many of these ABC stations following this telecast. Quinn on third down and two. Throws the ball to the sidelines. Pass complete. First down deep in Oklahoma territory to Tim Smith. First down, Nebraska at the Oklahoma 11. They send Johnson in motion, give it to Franklin, the fullback, and he runs it down to about the seven. Going to put it up. Going to get sacked. Back at the 15 by Sherwood Taylor, the blitzing safety. To the 15-yard line now, third down. Ball is given off to have uh, to the other guard, Schlossner, <laughs> and Schlossner scores. This time it is Schlossner, the other guard, getting the handoff from the quarterback. And how do you do, Randy's in the record book. That is a sensational call, Keith. I don't ever remember anything so dramatic. Well, they put this one on the ground. Instead of handing it to him, they laid this one down. Well, it fooled everyone. And in the stadium and also the Oklahoma team. The fans don't know what happened. Well, I can tell you what happened. Randy Schlossner just scored a touchdown. Sukup's kick is good. Now comes decision time. Does Nebraska kick it deep or do they try the onside kick? But let's go back to the play now. Now, the big guy on the right side of the quarterback, when he raises up, you'll see his number, number 53. Now, Quinn takes the snap, turns around. There goes the fullback by him. Ball is down on the ground. See it? He just left it laying there, and it's picked up by Schlossner, and he's on his way to a touchdown. That a boy, big guy. I love to see those big dudes in the trenches get some <laughs> moments like that. Keith, that's the most dramatic call I think I've seen in a long, long time with so much at stake. Third down, and what was it? Third and 15. Kicks it deep. And I do mean deep. <laughs> Into the crowd. Yes, sir. All right, J.C. Watts turns and gives the ball to Billy Sim. Second down and about five, a little more than that. Fullback dives, got a yard. J.C. Watts, they get him. Oklahoma will have to punt it. Keeling. Gets it off. Good kick. Ball is fielded by Dave Legal. Can't go back on the network a third time because their appearances have been used up. Jeff Quinn on a roll, got room. 
And he gets it to the 35. Second down four from the 35. Quinn still got it. This time, number 38. Quinn throws it. It's intercepted. Mike Babb comes up with it. Quinn forced the ball. Second interception, and Babb stepped right in front of the intended receiver. And with a minute 56 seconds to play in a ball game, that just might do it. Now all the Sooners have to do is pick up a first down and chew up the clock. They give it to Sims, and Sims dives. Second down, eight. Oklahoma with a minute 20 to play in the game. They're just trying to grind it out, get a first down. If they can get one first down, they can run out the clock. We'll receive from Chevrolet in the names of those players $1,000 each for their general scholarship fund. Third down, four. Sims. Well, he didn't get his first down. And just make sure nobody gets through. There's some pressure. The kick is away into the end zone. It hits there, and ricochets off the field of play. Up they come with Jeff Quinn at quarterback. Straight back. Good protection, throws it deep. Miller's out there. Miller can't get to it. 48 seconds to play. Swing pass to Jarvis Redwine. 25 seconds to play. Pass to the sidelines to Andrew Franklin. Fourth and three. is incomplete. Tate deflected it. One snap. That's all they need. That'll do it. Penalty flag goes down. That'll stop the clock as we got a little ruckus breaking out. Frustration. He winds it and it's going. Well, they, they started late with the clock, but now it's academic. The football game is over. Miami, here comes Oklahoma. Dallas, here comes Nebraska. So Billy Sims closes out his college career at Oklahoma with a magnificent performance against one of the best football teams in this country, old rival, the Nebraska Cornhusker. I believe that may have been the most spectacular effort by one player I've seen in a long, long time. That one 70-yard run, 71-yard run he made was just incredible. Travel arrangements made through and promotional fee paid by United Airlines. More people fly United to Hawaii.